Hello, you awesome people! We are in Jolaheim uh, today because I figured we haven't been here in a while and, and Saga wants something to do with us. So let's see. Uh, Saga, wait, wait, what? What do you want? Hello, Rose. I've got a message for you. I'm right in thinking I can't trust you not to tell anyone, right? It's a little bit sensitive. See, Isolde asked me if I knew anybody who could help her with a sensitive task and I thought of you immediately. She really wants to talk to Tristan and try to set things right between them, but he just refuses to talk to her. Would you be able to talk to Isolde? She really needs your help. Okay, I guess we could do that, so let's travel to... Uh, yeah, well, he's still in the pigsty, so we're heading over to uh, Goldspurs, where we can find Isolde. No, we cannot... well, anyway... <laughs> She's actually inside Jarlaheim, so uh, let's go. And let's go into the city, but we can go this way too! This is a very pretty, pretty road. I mean, who lives there? It would be nice to see if I, we would ever uh, be able to meet someone who lives there. Uh, yeah. Let's see now. Down here. Hi, Zolde. How you doing? Oh, hello, Rose. So Saga sent you to help me out. I should have come straight to you myself. I know you always step, to, step up. In, uh, thanks for st stepping up, Rose. I have no idea what I should do. Seems like Tristan blames me and Loki for everything, even though it was him who caused all the trouble. <sighs> He's so immature. Me and Loki want us want us all to be friends again, but I don't know how I can make Tristan understand. Can you talk to him, Rose? As soon as I try to talk to him, he just narrows his eyes at me and turns away. You'll talk to him. Okay, I guess we could. I don't know what that would do. Oh, wow. Thanks, Rose. Thank you so much. Uh, let's see if we can talk some sense into him. I, what? <laughs> he shouldn't like us either. I mean, we were the one who found all the pieces together that knew it was him. <laughs> like, why would he want to talk to us? That's just weird. La, la, la. I just love how our braid just flows in the wind. Like, lolly, lolly, lolly. Let's see now, here, uh, open, dude with the piggies, hello piggy, hello, <clears throat> what, why are you even here, you've ruined my life Rose, get away from me, well, told you, he wouldn't like me, <laughs> haven't you already done enough to mess things up for me Rose, what do you want from, want now, my sister wants me and her to be friends again, and Loki as well, how dare she, Urgh, it's her fault. All of this is her fault. Her and Loki, if they'd never met, then I'd never have to steal those stupid chickens. Why do I have to work here with these filthy pigs? Should be Loki doing this, not me. Everything is Loki's, is Soldis, and your fault, Rose. You can tell her that from me. Now get lost. Well, yep. Uh, well... That didn't go well. Did it now? No, it did not go well. And I knew it wouldn't go well. Like, of course he would blame us. We, we, he should blame us. <laughs> we, we discovered his little scheme. Mm -mm. So, yeah, he should be pissed. Big, big pissed. <laughs> yeah, didn't go well. No, no. What did he say? Oh, why do he has to have to be so stupid and immature? I'm just worried for him and want the best for him. Heroes, I wanted to give this, these to Tristan, but I don't think he'd ever accept them. You take them instead. Do you think Tristan will n ever change sometimes, Rose? You think he will? Well, I guess we should never give up hope. You're right. See you around, Rose. Take care. Oh, what did we, oh we got some boots. Oh, well, lovely. Let's keep these. Oh, I have a mess in here. Uh, let's do uh, this. So, yeah. Okay, I knew this would be short. So let's head over to the paddock island. We have tons to do here in Jalaheim, so I figured let's spend some time here. Uh, do, 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 do. Uh, 
Do, 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 do. Also, a little secret, but we are going to end this episode with a bit of uh, welcoming someone to the family. And I'm not gonna tell you which one yet. It's gonna be a surprise. Uh, but let's go down here. Oh, I went on shopping. I just love these boots that came one like two weeks ago or something. And and this this uh, this hoodie is just absolutely gorgeous. Wow, it's a bit laggy today. Stop it. Uh, hi. Hey there, Rose. Thanks for everything you've done for us. We met so recently, but you already feel like a part of the family. We weren't sure how best to thank you for all your help, but we will pitch in to get your little present, which we hope you'll see as a thank as a thank you with a space for all your help. Thank, talk to Bob. He's got the present with him, but he also but he said he also had a little extra surprise for you. Exciting, huh? See you around. Oh, she's so adorable. This little girl. Oh, she's so cute. Absolutely cutie cutie cute. So let's see now. Uncle Boob. Let's let's take a bit of a shortcut. Jump. Bum, bum, ba, bum, 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 ba, Here I come, Uncle Bob. Hi. <laughs> hey there, Rose. Feeling like competing? What? <laughs> so Doris said we have present for you. She shouldn't have said anything. It was meant to be a surprise. <sighs> she said that you were getting surprised as well. Okay, she seems to have mixed everything up. Well, she is an old lady, so... So here's what we thought. I've been thinking for a long time about having a race here on Pydoc Island. And after I saw how much help you've given everyone here, I realized that I I'd be thinking about it for too long. And that now was the time to actually do something about it. So I rolled up my sleeves and worked all night long, so now it's ready. The Paddock Island Wilderness Race. So the whole point is that you should get the first shot at riding the course and as a prize for finishing it, you'll get your present from us. I guess it was so important that we got surprises and presents mixed up. What do you say then? Do you want to take part in this brand new race? Of course we want, I mean, it's a new race. Great, I'll count you in. Okay, let's see. I'm getting some shoes again. So let's get this. This was... <laughs> when this came the first time... Well, a lot of people didn't like it. I do believe there are some people who still don't like it. <clears throat> but that is just... It's a race. If you have a... Oi. If you have an old model like I do right now, this race is pretty... Okay. Uh, once you learn the road uh, or the, the track, you pretty much figure it out. Uh, but if you have an, a newer model, this track can be a bit difficult. You have to like really get everything right or you'll get stuck. But uh, believe you me, there are worse courses than this. At least I believe so. Uh, I do believe that some people don't like it because you can't just go all full. Uh, gallop all the time because when you get to this corner you actually should be slowed down if you don't want to get stuck so yeah and some people jump there I don't because I have no idea and, yeah. and then the last I actually like this race it's short and it's complicated and I like it go good Selby good boy well written, Rose, very well written. Here's your gift. It's from all of us here on Paddock Island. Thanks for all your help. Oh, and we got some shoes. Let's see. Ah, some ballerina shoes on that. So, well, that was even more faster than I thought. Um, so let's see now. Well, you know what? Let's get our new friend and we can look some properly into her. Or no, wait. Should we? Or should. There's just not that much else to do. That it, 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 yeah, let's get our new friend. Our, this episode might get a bit too short. So, our new friend is this right here. We're getting a Shire. Or Sheer. Yeah. <laughs> uh, anyway, this girl right here. We are buying her, and her name is 
gonna be... Let's see now, what was I thinking? I was thinking... Yeah. Red, I believe a lot of people has probably named this horse this, but I have it for a reason, because of her name. Pepper! Red Pepper. And she is named after Pepper Potts, who you meet a lot in the Iron Man movies and also in Avengers 1. Uh, I don't remember if it was in 2. No, I don't believe she was in 2. But yeah, uh, Pepper Potts, she is Tony Stark's assistant and also right now girlfriend. Or did they break up late last time? Anyway, so let's uh, uh, let's call home, and I'll cut here, and then we are going to look at this gorgeous girl. So I'll see you very soon. So here we have her, our beloved Pepper Potts. She is a giant cheer. Uh, she is absolutely adorable. She's a chestnut, and that is why I felt like she should be named Pepper. Um, what else to say? I have done a review on the Shire that you can find in uh, the playlist uh, Rose Reviews. And there you can hear my thoughts on the Shire horse. I have done some leveling and this pretty pretty girl will be in the next video on the Let's Play of Star Stable Online. So people, this turned out to be a short video but I promise in the next episode we are going to be headed we are going to be starting building something of a tent. I think you know where I'm going with that. So, in the meantime, people, stay awesome, as always, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye!